Toshiro Kenoiba has thrown his weight behind the Gunso government reserved area regeneration scheme, an initiative of Prince Dapa Biodo's administration, which is set to restore the state's reserved area faded glory. Oba Adidako Adewali Tejosho made this declaration as he received in his palace Commissioner for Housing Jagmolu, Ak Jagmolu Akonde Omoni and his team who are on a mission to market the project and also seek his royal blessings. Bumi Adigo reports. The project is taking shape Clearing of the major part of the land done, spacing and alignment to square meters and plots ongoing as the date of groundbreaking and beginning of work to be announced any moment from now. The process of this mega project to fully take off in the state capital, it is the continuation of sensitization visits to the traditional rulers who are the custodian of the land. First, it was a visit to the palace of Alaki and permanent ruler of the land, Obadedotu Aremu Badebo, followed by a visit to Olowu of Oru, Obasaka Adelolama Temelola, who received the team in company of the Balogun of Oru, Chief Olushegun Obasanjo, and now it is the turn of Oshile Okeonaeba, Oba Adedapo Adewale Tejosho, like his previous visits, Jagumolu Jamu Akwadiyamani opened the minds of the people of Okeonaeba to the project and the limitless opportunities accruable through the project. Because these houses are no longer the fitting of the standard, are no longer the fitting of being of adorning uh, GRA. I feel good that this has better look and our people, both home and abroad, both even those in Nigeria deserve better places to have at their country home. Obadidapo Adewale Tejosho commended the Prince Dapa Bebu Lord Administration's achievements. Since he came into office, he confirmed that they are people oriented projects. The icing on the cake was the support of the royal father on the regeneration scheme. As he said, it is long overdue. I can only congratulate you very heartily for these lofty projects that you have in mind to leave behind as a legacy from your government. I must say that um, I personally have been impressed with the projects you are carrying out. In this day and age, where people are crying, shouting, there is no money. But the government is still finding money to carry on with these uh, projects. By the grace of God, you will be able to find money as well to assist or help the indigents to enjoy the fruit of your labor. Over 500 artisans will be engaged to work daily at project sites as this project remains a legacy project. Bonia Digo, OGT News.